Hello everyone, I want to talk to you about an important safety protocol that we have newly brought in at India Hikes. The new safety protocol mandates that every trekker who is 58 years or older does a treadmill test before going on a high altitude trek. Now some of you may wonder or even question why is a treadmill test required before going on a trek. All of you will agree that a high altitude trek is a very strenuous affair and no amount of preparation can actually match up to the stresses and strains that you are going to undergo on the trek. Over the years, we have also noticed many of our senior trekkers coming on the trek and experiencing some kind of discomfort and later on going to find out about an underlying heart condition. Now these heart conditions are actually very silent, they don't show up any symptoms but going on a high altitude trek with an underlying heart condition can be very dangerous not only on the trek but also for your health and longevity later on after the trek. That's why a simple, non-invasive, quick and also a cheap test like the treadmill test can go a long way in ensuring the safety of our trekkers. A treadmill test or a stress test is used to determine the effects of exercise on your heart. The test is pretty straightforward. You will have to walk on a treadmill while your heart is monitored with an ECG. The speed and the incline of the treadmill will vary. The results of the test show how well your heart responds to the stress of various kinds of exercise. With the help of this test, you can also diagnose uh, abnormal heart rhythms like arrhythmias and it also helps in the diagnosis of the presence or absence of coronary artery disease. The test itself is quite straightforward. Adhesive electrodes will be placed onto your chest to monitor an ECG and your blood pressure, heart rate and a resting ECG will be recorded. Then you will start walking on the treadmill. The walk will first be slow and then the pace will slowly pick up. It is important that you give your best and put in as much effort as possible because the test is effort dependent. The technologist or your doctor will be constantly monitoring you throughout the test. It is imperative that you tell your doctor or the technologist if you have any symptoms during the test like shortness of breath or chest pain or any abnormal or extreme fatigue. Following the test, you will be asked to lie down and your heart rate, blood pressure and ECG will continue to be monitored for around 3 to 5 minutes after the test. Uh, it's been about a month since we have introduced the treadmill test and I am happy to tell you that many of our senior trekkers have welcomed this move. Uh, some of them have actually gone on to change their trek plans based on the test results. So if you are 58 years old or more and if you are planning to go on a trek, get a treadmill test done. We are okay if the test is done any time in the last one year before the start of the trek. Coronary diseases take time to develop. Uh, but if you test positive, uh, all our advice is for you to follow your doctor's suggestions. This may mean that you have to change your trek plans or even cancel your trek. Uh, your safety comes first. All the best.